everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is my friend Lisa Anderson. Um, so we're both friendly new to YouTube and today we're going to be talking about our shitty ex-boyfriends. Um, so... <laughs> oh, I have so many. <laughs> Um, the first one that really stands out to me is, um, his name's Shade. <laughs> Shade. His name is Shade. Calling him out here. Um, I dated him twice, actually, which, he was shitty the first time, so I don't know why I thought the second time would be any different, but he was just shitty. He just treated me badly. He called me fat all the time, and, like, I wasn't even fat back then. <laughs> like, I would not eat in front of him because he called me fat, like, all the time. And he always told me that nobody at my high school liked me, oh my God. which must have stuck with me because I ended up transferring to a different <laughs> school, like, after that. That's terrible. He used to tell me all the time that I wasn't popular enough for him, and I'm like, why are you with me then? Like, but I was, it was like my sophomore year, I think, and I was really depressed my sophomore year, so I think I just kind of put up with it. Like, I didn't really care. Yeah. And the reason that he stands out to me so much is, um... We were sitting at lunch and I was not eating, of course, <laughs> and he showed me a nude of this other girl that she sent him and was like, yeah, so-and-so sent me this nude, like, what do you think about it? And, I, and this is how messed up I was in the head at that time, like, I was just like, oh, cool, and like, didn't, like, genuinely didn't care. Like, that's how sad and just depressed I was that I just, you know, when you're so sad that you just don't care about anything. That was me in that whole relationship. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> so, the first one that stands out to me is my ex that I dated for almost two years. He was a piece of crap. Um, he's in jail now. Where he belongs. Where he belongs. Which is funny because Shade was in and out of jail too. Really? Um, and he was... He was crazy honestly like legitimately crazy um i would try to leave him so many times and he'd be like oh i'm gonna kill myself oh i'm gonna do this oh, blah 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 he was one of those yeah. um but yeah then i think he got tired of being in a relationship with me so he decided to cheat on me and then shit. yeah <laughs> then we broke up after that um and now he's in jail and yeah what a piece yeah. i know when i think about all the ex-boyfriends i've had and why they're shitty it's because they've cheated on me Seriously. <laughs> like i dated um this kid alex <laughs> i'm calling him out here i don't give a fuck <laughs> um i dated alex for a little over a year and i think the reason that he was so shitty is because yeah he cheated me cheated on me a lot um i think i had a girl tell me and then i told him which was so stupid of me and i feel like a lot of girls do this um if you're just honest with me it's okay like if you just tell me the truth like just be honest about it like if something happened just tell me and this motherfucker still was not telling me the truth. Of course not. And I told him, dude, I'm going to be done with you if you can't just be honest. Like, this girl told me what happened and I believe her. Like, and he cried in the car and manipulated me, of course, and finally broke down. And then he was the type of dude that would just emotionally manipulate you and cry. Mm -hmm. I've never dated someone that cried so much. Oh, God. And he just would cry and be like, I don't know why I am the way I am. Like, I'm such a piece of shit. Like, he was just one of those guys. And the funny thing is, is like, I mean, he wasn't the best looking guy, but he was like pretty successful. He had his own business at like 20 oh, wow. and he was in college. He was killing it. Like, he didn't have like a ton of reasons to have such bad self-esteem, mm -hmm. but he did seem like the type of guy that cheated because he was insecure of himself. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. But he was a piece, like, honestly. And when we broke up, um, I broke up with him. And he's, like, the only guy I've ever dated that 
didn't try to get me to not break up like I broke up I've never like not to sound crazy or anything but I've I've never been broken up with I break up with everyone and usually <laughs> I'm used to them being like no don't break up with me and this dude just like silent oh, I was like oh I, I probably should have done this a long time ago <laughs> then like ugh. so my next one Okay, I'm gonna freaking say their names. <laughs> His yes. name was Robbie. Um, <laughs> what up, Robbie? <laughs> <laughs> and we dated like this was before my other ex, but we dated like my sophomore or junior year of high school, and he seemed really nice and like pretty good at first. Fairly <laughs> soon. <laughs> and <laughs> then one day, like we were together, and he was like looking at his phone. This is back in the day when there was Kick, you know, oh, that messenger app. The fuckboy app, I Yeah, think. he yeah. had it. <laughs> of course. <laughs> and there's this girl on there calling him babe. I'm like, why is this girl calling you babe? He's like, oh, it just makes her feel more comfortable with me or all this stuff. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> See, excuses that guys try to give. <laughs> right? Okay, well, anyways, we broke up after that. And then fast forward to, like, before me and my current boyfriend got together. He was hitting me up and we hung out and I didn't know he had a girlfriend and guess what? He had a girlfriend and I tried to tell her about him and she didn't believe me. <laughs> you know, <laughs> reminds me of Alex. <laughs> like, I, I feel like everybody told me that he was a piece and I'm like, no, I have to figure it out for myself. But that reminded me, um, he... So Alex was two years older than me, mm -hmm. and he was 20, 21 when we dated, I'm pretty sure, 21. So I was what, like 18? Okay, maybe he was only 20. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. But I was like 18, 19 years old when we were together, and he cheated on me with a girl that was like 16. What? And they dated for like years afterwards. Really? Like they might still be together. I have no idea, what honestly. I don't like check on their shit or anything, but I remember um, he was acting very sketchy and I knew it was back in the day when Snapchat would show your friends, your best friends, mm -hmm. and she was his top best friend. Oh, I'm like, why is this other girl your top best friend? <laughs> like, who is this girl? So I, I feel like I'm not super like jealous <laughs> or crazy. <laughs> I, like, I feel like some girls are really crazy mm -hmm. and I'm not. So I was like, oh, well, she's his friend. <laughs> Dumbly, I thought that. <laughs> But I was like, okay, well, I'll become friends with her. Like, it was kind of like, maybe if I become friends with her, like, I'll know if they're actually, like, talking, you know? Mm -hmm. So I tried to become friends with her, and that did not go well. <laughs> like, we hung out a couple times, and she was just shady as fuck, because she was talking to him, and then was trying to be my friend at the same time. Oh, my God. And um, one night, I was supposed to hang out with him, and he wouldn't text me back or something, and... I was like, oh, what is, what is going on? And then I get a text from this other guy that I know that's like, hey, so Rachel, and yeah, that's her name too. <laughs> Rachel and Alex are at his house right now and like his parents have a cabin somewhere else so they would be gone every weekend. Mm -hmm. So he has like a 16 year, 16 year old over at his house sleeping over. It was so disgusting. And someone texted me and said like, yeah, they left the bowling alley together. And I was like, ew. And that guy had been sleeping with Rachel. <laughs> and so he was really upset too. Like he was like, what the heck? I thought me and her were gonna date. Like, so he was like, we should go drive by Alex's house and see if they're there. And I was like, okay. And it's like, to this day, the craziest thing I've ever done. But we drove by his house and her car was there. And he had a 16 year old staying the night with him. And I'm so petty. I texted his mom and told him, told her. Like, I was like, you know your, like, 21-year-old son has a 16-year-old sleeping over, right? And I'm pretty sure his mom freaked on him. But um, it was funny because that same guy was like, oh, well, they're obviously sleeping together, so we should, too, you know, to get back at them. And I'm like, we should not. And, of course, we never fucking did. But, yeah, that reminded me of how shitty he was. Yeah. Like, and I got back together with him after that. 
Oh my god. <laughs> like, what? And we were only together for like three or four months after that, and then I fucking called it quits, but. So, my next one. His name was Jesus, and he's crazy too. <laughs> she attracts the crazy. <laughs> he still tries to hit me up. And let's see. Oh, the reason why we broke up, he broke up with me because of something I said in my sleep. I wish I was okay, lying. that's like real crazy. Then. I know. What? What did yeah. you say? <laughs> what the fuck did I I'm say? sure we're all wondering like, what she said. Let me think. I really can't even remember. You don't like, even, it, like was it was something, something so, so dumb. Stupid. Oh my god. Yeah, it had to do with like some other, I don't know, person, I guess, and he got mad. But it was really stupid. So yeah, that's why we broke up, and now he still tries to hit me up. <laughs> was he like a shitty boyfriend too? Uh, no, not really. He's just crazy. No, he was just yeah off his rocker. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Um, I guess the last boyfriend that I'll talk about is Bailey. Um, <laughs> he. Um, <laughs> he had a kid with. We were young, <laughs> and he had a kid with this other girl that he got pregnant when she was in like eighth grade mm -hmm. and um i like trusted that he wasn't gonna try to get back with her while we were still together but he 100 percent was hitting her up like while we were together and she told me about it and i believe women when they tell me that shit so i freaked out on him but he was also another one that like I broke up with him and he kind of was like no don't break up with me but was also kind of like well I wanted my baby mama anyways and it's like why why did you choose to date me mm -hmm. if you were not over her right but he's kind of a shitty person too he's not too bad but he's kind of a shitty person okay okay I got <laughs> okay so I think this will be the last one. yeah okay so the last one for me his name was Keenan and oh my god, I really like that name though. <laughs> um, and he would just like, like he wanted me to be his girlfriend, so I was his girlfriend. And then he would just like, not talk to me. <laughs> it was like the weirdest thing. How old were you? Because um, it sounds like some middle school. <laughs> No, he didn't I even was, talk it was to me. after high school. Oh like, my god, that's weird. And like, he had this friend that lived across the street from him, and it was a girl. And I was kind of like suspected something going on between them, but I didn't know. Then he also had this ex that was pregnant at the time, and he didn't know if it was his or not. And so he was keeping in contact with her, and it was just all really fishy. And then, like, I just ended it with him. And then, after the fact, he hits up my best friend and said, Oh, I always thought you were so much prettier than her and all this stuff. I'm like, oh my god, are you kidding Men. me? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my well, little what? boys. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah, so those were some of our failed relationships. Yeah. Shitty <laughs> love choices, <laughs> right. I guess. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and like, comment, and subscribe and subscribe to my friends here and we will play each other's. Yeah, um, or I, I didn't say it in my video, but yeah, we'll put we'll it put, in the description yeah. each other's. Um, we did a video on my channel as well. Yeah. So, so. yeah, check it out. <laughs>